Yeah, I met uh, Mother Teresa at a Carmelite convent in Little Rock. She was there in Little Rock to start a home for unwed mothers. And uh, uh, my mother took, took me to see her. And I got a five minute audience with her. She stood behind this wall that came up to uh, about her waist or her mid thighs. And I stood on the other side of the wall and visited with her. And uh, here's what she said. Well, you accept the gift. And you know, I didn't know there was any gift. She didn't give me anything. She just let me talk to her. So I said, I, so I played along. I said, yeah, I'll accept the gift. And she said, will you keep the secret? And I thought to myself, and this, this lady's pretty old. Uh, what does she mean, secret? What secret is there? She's Mother Teresa. This is a little rock. We're at a Carmelite nunnery. And anybody could walk in any minute. But I didn't want to bother her. So I said, sure, I'll keep the secret. That, that was it. That was my five minutes with Mother Teresa. Well, what was the secret? don't know. I don't know. And I don't know what the gift is either. <laughs> it looks like Mother Teresa pulled one over on you. Yeah. Yeah, but I saw she had real big feet. She was real tall and she was kind of hunched in the shoulders and, and very arthritic. The bones in her feet were all swollen and everything. She was wearing sandals. And, and, and uh, the Calcutta habit that she always wore. And uh, I, I said something about the deformity of her feet. And, and then I felt real bad about it. I said, that's pretty bad arthritis. And she just looked at me like, hey, that's not what you're here for. But I, I met the living light, Mother Teresa. I met her five minutes and she said will you accept the gift and I said yes I'll accept the gift not knowing what gift it was and, and she said will you keep the secret and I said sure I'll keep the secret not knowing what the secret was you know those are the easiest secrets to keep the ones you don't know that's an astute point but I, when I found out she was a saint, uh, about th uh, 25 or 30 years later, I realized, damn, I met a saint. I met a saint. I used to get mad at him up at Bongo Java for having the Mother Teresa nun bun because she really was an important person. But, uh, you know, uh, any any memory of Mother Teresa is better than no memory, even if they say she's a sweet girl. 